Good morning guys, how are you doing? Welcome back to another video. If not someone upon my page, if you do not know who I am, you don't wanna go anywhere. My name is Peter Roberts. I have a lot in store for you guys today and I have a lot of mowing footage that is gonna be coming your way today. So I'm gonna keep it short, but today is just gonna be out there. It's currently 85 degrees out and it's early in the morning. So um, we're gonna keep the day rolling guys. I'm gonna show you what I'm gonna do. I'm just basically just bust down all this mowing footage for you. So guys, if you continue to watch my videos, you don't know how much this means to me. I appreciate you. Please feel free to like, comment, and even subscribe by the end of this if you think it's worth trying, but I know it is. So, guys, I have the coffee, the banana. Let me see if someone's calling. The banana and the mowers. We're ready to get going, guys. I'll see you on the mower. So guys, we were at the third property of the day. As you can see, we got some good mowing done. Um, before that video, we did a small, uh, really small yard that I didn't get footage of, but um, as that one property we just left, uh, there's this lady who I always, always been serving lately, and she just wants to get every penny out of my service. She's out there five, 10 times before I even leave asking to do more things. But I don't know if you've ever done this, but something I wanna tell you guys is that you cannot just let her come. Like I cannot, there was a time where I was just like let her whatever she wanted I would do for free for free um, but you gotta just let her know if you want this extra it's extra uh, I'm not here um, I'm trying to be as time efficient as possible so something that I learned really fast is do not there's a time when you accept like small gestures but there's a time where you don't just don't do free work um, if it's every 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 week and you just see this trend so something I did uh, I'm gonna turn this camera around here we are at the next property it's a zoyser grass property so we're gonna get it mowed up striped all that stuff so more mowing footage right now Honey, I'm what does perfect even mean? Is there even such a thing? Oh, can we switch up all the rules? And imagine a utopia Darling, I'm just so fed up with these expectations They keep weighing me down My heart is begging me to get the hell out of my lane I don't wanna live inside the upside down For a minute and pretend Honey, I'm a perfect ten, whoa, whoa Honey, I'm a perfect ten, whoa, whoa And if I say it enough, it gets ingrained in my head And I start to see Honey, I'm a perfect ten Disgusted with 
Yes, we're still moving out here. We are at another property here, and I want to flip the camera and show you guys what I'm dealing with. That pastar was super overgrown. I cut it about three um, inches, but the lady, the homeowner, wanted to cut shorter, so um, that's why we had some excess grass there, but I hope you were able to see some stripes. But now, these, I don't know if you guys have this in your yards, or I'm going to show you what I'm dealing with, but um, those little things that you pull and you can shoot, are definitely um, littered in this yard. I'm gonna show you how I'm gonna get rid of these guys and um, a little bit what I'm working with here right now. So, taking on a quick little property walk through. Someone cut the sides here, but as you guys can see here, all these little white, they're about two, two foot tall. Take it down like that, but yeah, they're super long and they're also scattered in the backyard, so. Um, yeah, we're gonna get the camera set up here. We're gonna knock this all out. And this stuff is overgrown. We are ready to tackle it out. I'll see you guys on the mower in a second. We have got the property mode here as you can see before um, hopefully the mowing footage turned out great but this was pretty tall here I cut it at three inches here with the cup cadet so I want to show you guys exactly how it turned out I'm pretty pleased and pretty excited to show you um, kind of just getting the property cleaned up um, try to stripe it up as best as possible but we're gonna keep going at this long guy here but then in the backyard to get through the fence and yeah so everything was pretty high uh, everything was not really well kept so that's a two week cut so that's kind of why um, we keep it keep it like that and why I try to cut it as low as possible but 
Guys, we are mowing still. We have a day ahead of us. Um, if you made it this far, thank you for watching. Uh, I'm going to show you guys what I'm going to be doing here as we take on some townhouses. But um, I hope you guys are having an amazing day. I hope you guys are watching and enjoying some of this footage here. Um, I'm going to keep you along and I'll show you guys. I'm not sure where we will be. But because um, we do have some townhouses to mow up here. So it's kind of hard to get super good uh, mowing footage. So if you guys or in the process of, of building a landscaping or lawn care company. Um, I recommend just take on as many jobs as you can um, at first. This is the little section of um, tip of the day, so let me leave this here right now since I did not announce in the beginning of the video, but take on as many jobs as you can in the beginning of your lawn care or landscaping journey. Something that you will see is that just the word of mouth is able to grow and spread your business um, over time. So. These townhouses I've got were one of my first um, properties that I, I started mowing, and that's why I never let them down because they help get me on. Um, they help provide me uh, to start up my business. So I'm going to go mow them. They're not the most profitable, but um, guys, get as many, get in as many communities as you can. This is a small community up the street here, but um, we're staying local. But don't deny or turn down businesses, even though the profit margins aren't the best. Um, a, a townhouse around here um, takes me about 10, 15 minutes to cut, but it takes. But I get uh, paid like $25 uh, per house. Simple, simple stuff. But um, that's what we're doing here. We're, we're going to crank out some townhouses. It's just more of the part of uh, the time it takes to get there, unload, uh, reload, and just the inconvenience of not being able to really. I don't know, it's just a super difficult um, like situation, but um, if you can get them in the community, you can get a few done lined up. You can do four, 25 a piece, that's 100 bucks, you could probably do in 30 minutes. So, something I say is never turn down business when you get started, and always um, show love and take care of those who allowed you to put on. Don't turn your customers against you. So, I'm going to show you guys kind of what this townhouse looks like, and I'll walk you around the property once it gets mowed, but um, it is on the water, and we're moving, and we're growing, so... Stick with me here, I'll show you guys after the completion of the townhouse property. Stay tuned. So guys, we just got done doing the two um, townhouses. I'm sorry I couldn't get that footage. It was just a weird situation. Um, and also, I really can't really get great footage, guys. I'll show you exactly what the size of these townhouses look like, but it probably takes me 10 minutes to do a full cut. Um, this is a push mower and a weed whacker. Get in my hand, get it going. So I'll show you guys what it looks like so you can see, but like, one of those guys, and it's basically just pulled my trailer. Basically just pulled my trailer. They're small. Sometimes they're even small enough where I just use my weed whacker just to knock them out. That was what I did in the first one, but um, yeah, like I said, um, townhouses, I, I, that was some work that I first got out uh, when I first started getting into the lawn care um, business. Uh, I couldn't say no to work, and then people are still here um, servicing and it's it's fun so guys i'm not really sure what the rest of the day entails i did nine yards today um by myself and we got a lot more to do tomorrow but we're mowing we're getting it done um and i'm sorry if i didn't include any of the footage of some of the houses some of the houses are hard to set up um, and really get good footage but um, i hope i got them three um decent houses in where we get some mowing done and guys a few want to continue to follow this journey um it's gonna be every day guys i'm just gonna um keep documenting and keep taking you guys along so i really appreciate you watching um reach out to me guys i'd love to get to know you and i'd love to like um throw out any advice so the tip for the day was about the townhouses i hope you didn't miss that um every day is a tip this is a message we're gonna go we're gonna provide some value document and get it done guys like i said i'm a college student here trying to hustle hustle grind and a little, make a little bit of money for myself and make a way for myself and my future so guys i hope you enjoy this uh, if you're out there mowing today stay cool it is hot out uh, we're almost we're in peak summer um i don't know when summer starts but we're grinding guys i love being in front of this camera here i love sharing you guys what i'm doing what i'm doing i hope i can provide as much knowledge and motivation for you to get started in your lawn care journey no matter where you are no matter where you are at in your life guys i want you to go make a way for yourself find um, something that you really enjoy that will help escape the way or, or let you get out of the way that you don't want to uh, be living in so guys go out there do this for yourself um if you're not like comment subscribe do that for me right now um thanks for watching and there is so much more to come guys peter roberts uh, i appreciate you guys i love you all and i'll see you in the next one